first i want to clarify what is health i think health is a state of condition like state of uh, mental health or maybe physical both so how are you yeah yeah good afternoon i am well i am well thank you for asking what about you yeah i am also doing great thanks for asking okay so how is your day going on my day till now was hectic <laughs> i was at school but right now i am at home yeah i told yes timing is a little bit changed in the school right now that's why i gave this time to you okay. earlier it was 3 uh, till 3 o'clock i always uh, be in my school but right now uh, because of the heat wave government has changed the school timing that is now 7 to 1 Okay, so that's the reason. Yes. So may I know about yourself because we are meeting for the first time. Yeah, sure. Yeah, I'm Preeti and I'm an English teacher. I'm teaching in a private school. Basically, I'm from Haryana and right now I'm living in Bahadur, but that is near New Delhi. If I talk okay. about my educational qualification, I have done my MBA, MBA English, and BA. I'm telling you, I'm running my two YouTube channels. One is Easy Way to Learn with Preeti. That is my study channel, and another one is Easy Way Blog. That is my entertaining channel. That's all about me. Okay, your plate is totally full. <laughs> A lot of work. You are managing your like personal work plus two channel. How do you manage entire thing? <laughs> It's not a big deal for me right now because I am habitual. <clears throat> okay, you are having a challenge. Ah uh, yes, I have been working in school. Uh, I think more than ten years, and uh, yes, uh, okay. it's my routine schedule. Yes, I started my uh, teaching career uh, before marriage, and uh, okay. yes, I am habitual now. It's it's uh, manageable for me. Like uh, half day I spend in school, and then. Usually, I take a power nap <laughs> during summer days, and then uh, yes, uh, that's why I always give uh, evening timing for the conversation. Okay. Yeah, I told you last time, but you told me I'm not free. Yes, yes. Somehow, yes, it happened. Like when I get free, you were busy, and when you have time, I was busy. So yes, yes Ruby, yes. you are also. Oh, yes. For me, yes. Please tell me about yourself. Yeah, of course, of course. I would love to introduce myself. So my name is Ruby Chaurasia, and I am from Ghaziabad, Uttar Pradesh. And speaking about my qualification, I have done post graduation and BA as well. And speaking about my hobbies, so I love reading books. And apart from that, now they I love to talk with the strangers. I mean, co learners. That's all about for my side. And I nowadays I'm in between job. I'm searching job. In between. Okay. Job. Yes. Good. So, do you want to do a teaching or any other profession? Teaching job. First of all, I try okay. in teaching field, and let's see otherwise some different field. Because you have already done. If every, I clear, uh, yes. Yeah. If I clear net, so I will try for professor, because net is compulsory. So I'm thinking hmm. like two time I will try this year or maybe in December. If I clear, so I will go for professor. Otherwise, teaching field. Yes. Okay. That's good. Yeah, teaching is good. A nice profession, you can say. Normal profession. Yeah. <clears throat> yes. So, uh, so we, uh, yes. Are you living with your family, or uh, you are living in hostel there? I live with my family. I stay with my family. Ghaziabad. I have been living there last okay, okay. fifteen years. Fifteen years. My family. Okay. So we okay. can talk on. Topic we have already decided here and there. So have you have you prepared any questions yes, yes. regarding this topic? Not uh, not prepared because uh, yes after one o'clock I raised at home and then I had one another conversation with another okay. call another yes. <laughs> so, so how many conversations? I'm not doing a conversation on regular basis, but yes. Uh, if I am getting mail and if I am sending request to someone, only in that case, uh, if the time is convenient, uh, convenient for both. In that case, I do one or two conversation in one day. But okay, sometimes depends on your regular basis. 
okay 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 yes yes and sometimes like if you told that we are connecting this time and that time and the learner they don't come on that time day before oh. yesterday uh, i wait at least one hour for <laughs> person that was so frustrating yeah. frustrating for me it yes yeah. yes yeah if you have no time i think we should send message also so that the another person yeah, time can yes don't waste time yeah many I person want do to this ask you. hmm Yes, yes, yeah. It's uh, it happens with me multiple times. I will send, I will send. And then so you are taking classes over there in English. Yeah, recently I watched your channel. I mean, one video. So recently I was doing English study. Okay. Actually, uh, yes, I had taken one month con uh, subscription of English Yari, and uh, in one month uh, we get uh, eight sessions there, and out of eight, uh, I took uh, till now six sessions. to our lab okay you have already so how is your experience over there yeah it was nice uh, yes uh, first uh, the very important and essential thing which i uh, remember like there are uh, expert teachers they uh, give feedback that is very nice like uh, if we are doing mistake and we are <clears throat> any type of mistake like intonation and grammar related vocab related or Uh, sometimes pronunciation related so immediately they uh, uh, rectify our mistake so that is the best thing which i hear <clears throat> yes otherwise overall yes, it is not hmm. okay okay i mean your experience is going well over there yes okay, yes okay because i saw one video yeah your, i uh, now oh, yes i upload only one yesterday i upload <clears throat> okay so i have one question related to this topic so what do you do for healthy life style nowadays what do you do hmm. for living healthy life style i think uh, yeah first i want to clarify what is health i think health is a state of condition like state of uh, mental health or maybe physical both so uh, if we talk about whole health so overall uh, how your body is working that is health like mental and physically how you are working it, it is so important not only nowadays earlier also but yes uh, it is modern era and uh, uh, we all are using modern gadgets so uh, it is the foremost important for everyone to be uh, healthy fit stay uh, healthy fit but uh, somehow we are losing our health and uh, the most important reason behind that i think uh, that is the comfort zone so we all uh, want to do in comfort zone and uh, for that we always uh, want to use uh, any uh, like facility like uh, we never want to go outside right now we don't want to live without ac we don't uh, want to live yes. without internet <laughs> nowadays so uh, what the uh, students and children are doing they always uh, want to stay idle they always want to lie on the bed and sofa and they just want to use internet connection mobile yes if any person have mobile and if that is full charged and you have internet connection i think uh, the person don't need any other thing even a <laughs> family members also so that is also the biggest reason behind the bad health uh health issues which we all are facing right now uh which i think what is your opinion about what that is, yeah i yeah, am I'm, i'm saying my opinion but uh, my question was that what do you do for living healthy lifestyle what hmm. do you do i mean this kind of food which kind of any routine do you follow hmm. yes yeah. uh if we want to stay healthy if we want to live healthy lifestyle and for that uh, there are so many points which we should do follow and one is the mo for most important that is healthy lifestyle and how that healthy lifestyle we can follow with the eatable thing like uh, what you are taking in the morning in breakfast in lunch and in evening uh, uh, i am also following one workout uh, nowadays and uh, in that workout and healthy uh, uh, meetings which i uh, personally observed like only 30% of our body uh, need exercise in a day and uh, our body works according to the exercise only 30% and rest of 70% is totally depend on the food 
like which type of yes, food we are taking and yes our food habit and our eatables habit like uh, if you are feeling uh, hungry so uh, sometimes we like to eat fast food so yeah and uh, we are not uh, following any type of routine and uh, time table for our healthy lifestyle like which time we have to get up which time we have to take uh, uh, how much water we have to take in one day and uh, which time which is the best time for breakfast and then lunch and then uh, dinner so i think if we follow any time table like uh, we have to take breakfast before 9 o'clock and then uh, till 1 o'clock we have to take lunch and then dinner before 6 o'clock or maybe uh, before 7 o'clock so that is important uh, sometimes what we do if we, uh, maybe we are if we are professional and we are not working anyway even though uh, this is the routine like uh, <clears throat> nowadays we are doing uh, we are taking dinner uh, near about 9 9 or 10 yeah that is eleven something yes and then uh, sleeping time we take uh, uh, ice cream <laughs> that is um i think that is bad for us uh, in uh, one reel of instagram uh, i uh, i followed most of healthy uh, lifestyle on instagram also and there is a uh, we should not eat ice cream uh, on any time not only evening on any time like ice creams are not good for our health so uh, yes, i think ियंटिंग Yeah, we all have great to eat ice cream, especially during summer days. And uh, yeah. <laughs> yes, and children like ice cream, packaged food, chips, uh, so chips, the, and yeah. other yes, other fast food no, items. Okay, maybe every people they are they want to eat ice cream, pizza, food because mm. really tasty, like mouth watering. When we mm. we eat this kind of food, so it's really captivating, and our mind is also occurring. We should try to eat more and more, and we forget our about our health. And after some days, maybe one week, two week, we we thought that we regret why we are eating this kind of food. Like we know mm. about everything, we have to face some consequences in future. We know about everything, but but we eat, yeah, like junk yes, food, yeah. fast food, uh, preserved food, container food. This is really really bad. But we are eating. We know about everything. But yeah, in end of that story, just because of taste. Yeah, because of the taste. <laughs> we all forgot and uh, yes <coughs> definitely we all are aware and educated even though we are using it yeah so we should control especially eating which type of food we should eat like like nowadays like a seasonal so we should try to eat seasonal fruits and veggies for living healthy lifestyle yeah i have one question here there yeah like nowadays uh, like air is also polluted day by day and we don't have a good drinking water and food is also really bad quality so how we get to stay he- healthy like nowadays it's really really tough so how we get to stay healthy like polluted air and water everything is getting toxic so what is your um, opinion yeah we uh, th- uh, listen uh, we, only one person ka it is not possible for a single person to control this type of pollutions like air soil and water everything but uh, yes if we uh, can play the role every single person can play the role uh, like uh, if we are not using water uh, we can uh, turn off the tap sometimes we can reuse water i also do this like uh, after watching uh, fruits and vegetable i always use that water in water for watering plants and sometimes after washing clothes i use that uh, water for mopping the floor <laughs> and uh, i yeah, uh, you can use, i learned all things in books also <laughs> yes and uh, okay, okay. yes especially on special occasion like in school we celebrate nowadays we are celebrating every occasion every uh, special moment like on earth day uh, we uh, all teachers taught to students in uh, assembly activity. how we can save our earth yes through activity we uh, are teaching to students and they are learning also 
but for only for one or two days they are learning and after that they are also yeah 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 sorry for interrupting you which class do you teach yeah i am taking tct classes like 5 to uh, 10 classes okay 5 to 10 yes okay so uh, your yes yes uh, like uh, every person can play this type of role like uh, if you want to stop air pollution uh, i am also using my own convince my i have uh, two wheeler like scooty i uh, i have and uh, i what i observe like in some families every single person have different car different uh, personal convince convince and they are using that so uh, i think in place of using personal vehicle we can use public transport and uh, if we are yes yeah, uh, so yes somehow yes we all are aware and we all have this knowledge like how we can control but even though we are not using like uh, this uh, type of thinking is uh, comes up in our mind how we can how i can control only i can it is a duty yeah. of every because perspective so yeah but being a citizen is your responsibility yeah yeah it's all about every... yeah suppose hmm. we are going here and there for cherry like veggies whatever so like wonder vegetable wonders give you ma'am please carry this um, like a cloth to bag but they can't carry hmm. you know i mean yes, government yes. is also running some for the running some schemes don't use plastic but we we are happy to we mm-hmm. also use like plastic bag and some this kind of thing we use yeah before two years uh, it was banned by do- uh, the government like uh, polythene uh, polythen bag but again that is uh, in the use so uh, i i don't know what is the reason behind it like sometimes government uh, try to take any good step but immediately it's after some time they are this then we then we find the root problem so because plastic uh, like bag and this kind of thing like cheap we can easily purchase hmm. so that's the reason because our hmm. human minds always always think like we what thing is very capable we can easily purchase purchase this thing so we can use those kind of things the main reason is that i have noticed i have observed yeah uh-huh. this thing so that's yeah. the reason how we can control in the hmm. government make lot of policies you have to stop this you have to stop that but in end of that story we don't have any result yeah yes so true yes yes <clears throat> okay so there you any questions you can ask yeah we were discussing about health so uh, what do you think yeah, what, uh, <laughs> yes uh, what the children and uh, modern era person should do to uh, stay healthy fit okay the what should we do this hmm okay so first of all like five to the three things are really really important for healthy lifestyle for average generation for kid for like 20 plus 30 plus we always do this kind of thing first of all we should try to control our like eating habit it's really really important we know about it this type of food we should try to consume everyone know that but in end of the story they 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 eat junk food this kind of things we know about it and second thing we all we also try to inculcate any exercise it can be anything like meditation yoga running yeah that is that is important breathing exercise mm. yeah we you know we should try to inculcate for every generation maybe it is really mm. important and in his schools i mean some guidance some counselor also available they taught the teachers you have to try to inculcate but uh, if we talk talk about student so maybe school can teach everything but somehow some some responsibility because of families also but to some hmm. family especially parents they have been parents is responsibility try to control everything because see like we say like a uh, every woman is the ceo of the house is that true so for women we try every women have this kind of knowledge how we can get it stay healthy and especially for family for kids for every generation especially mm. food and try to inculcate any like uh, exercise so maybe if we mm. add these two things so maybe 60 to 75 percent problem we can easily solve yeah mm. 
But now yes. they say yeah, another problem. I am I am saying this thing like a uh, you know this is the era of technology. It's a social media era. So every people that addicted, especially social media, not as kids. I, I mean every generation. So we should try to reduce like screening mm-hmm. time. So our mind mind will be healthy and bodies also. So these two things three things are really really important according to me. For yes. every generation, for kids, yeah. for younger generation, for yeah older everything, for every generation. Mm-hmm. What do you think on this topic? Yeah, I am fully agree with you. Fully agree with you. Like, uh, especially children, they are uh, they are uh, totally hundred percent habitual to uh, the use of screen. I notice yeah. uh, in my family also in my relatives, like uh, some children are like that. Uh, they if they have screen only, then they will eat anything. So first they uh, keep phone, mobile in their hands. Keep aside, and then uh, they have plate of breakfast and lunch. They are taking only then. And uh, sometimes my son also do this type of thing, but I always try to avoid that. Like uh, it is not allowed for you to use mobile during uh, if you are uh, while taking any food items. But uh, I think a mother should be strict. Only a mother can do this uh, yes. because yes, mother is the first teacher of a child. So only a mother can uh, remove this habit because grandparents always uh, put all love and affection on their uh, granddaughters and son, and uh, somehow they are taking us to uh, yes, children taking effort of this. They are uh, utilizing it as a habit, like uh, uh, please give me this, and only then I can do this. So <clears throat> I think uh, we should be strict in that case. and only uh, if we are uh, try to remove this habit in our uh, youth and in our uh, younger children and in that case somehow maybe our elders also because elder can easily uh, understand like uh, screening for more than one hour two hour is not good for us like uh, i am working and i have my personal phone i have my internet connection even though i am not habitual to use it and some uh, how if i am getting time like uh, if i am working in the kitchen i uh, keep my phone aside the uh, uh, utensils and i, I just w- like if to watch i am using for good reason i mean yes yes, yes. No, i always yeah i always, reason, yes, I always like okay. to hmm yes yeah. so i always like that, to watch hmm yeah i have few days that i read one article i don't know from where like which newspaper But I read where some children they are watching some cringe content during the scrolling like YouTube and this kind of thing. Maybe Al Jazeera, Al Jazeera maybe yeah. Hmm. So parents should uh, get some like apps. They can log this kind of website, cringe website, because children they are really I can say uh, habitual nowadays getting habitual watching this kind of cringe content. Yeah, so parents hmm. should taking care this kind of content. We should. try to watch and avoid so it is also really important mm. yeah yes it so to, you know uh, yes i know modern technique is important yeah and through this uh, gadget like technical gadgets we can learn so many new things there are so many youtubers and there are so many good tutors are also available like uh, so sometimes if you are not able to go in the school or you no know, you are not uh, uh, uh able to attend any coaching classes in that case you can um sit uh, at home and you can easily watch a lecture like any um, expert teacher lecture so in that valuable case, that content is, valuable yes, content yes valuable thing yes so in that case that is good and if you are using for uh, using mobile or screen for a good uh, content and good work that is nice but if you, uh, when we are scrolling anything so somehow any bad thing immediately comes in uh, on the screen and maybe that can attract to distract yes uh, especially to the youth and teenagers uh, because yes, yes. teenagers are in that age like they are not aware which is right and which is wrong so the um, curiosity always increase in uh, teenagers like uh, i have to open it and then see what is happening there 
so uh, that is bad like we all have this personal authority we can easily move our phone we can easily run our phone but yes we are Now aware every kid they are using they are using yes. mobile phone yes after corona after, after corona yes, yes. Uh, all yeah. uh, students and yeah. children have their all phone yes on yes 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 i have seen like uh, there is my neighbor he has a like a son maybe he is 6 year old and he, hmm. he has personal phone i was shocked <laughs> that's fine no it is very nice talking about health like uh, we are giving any uh, so many good tips healthy tips to the youth and teenagers and to everyone like we should uh, avoid the more and more use of mobile and screen and we should uh, uh, adopt healthy habit like exercise especially and proper uh, time table of food we should follow to stay healthy yeah. this was really good conversation with you maybe i learned bunch of things in this conversation yeah it is uh, i am also feeling very delighted after talking to you yes okay Okay bye bye So have a nice Take day bye bye <laughs> bye bye